What up, y'all? It's your boy, J-A-C-O double and back again with another episode of Get Right or Get Left. What? Today, we're going to get into some breaking entertainment news. Jay-Z was just on an interview with Gail King where she asked him about taking the 500K for dinner with Jay-Z. Yeah. Now, just my thoughts. I would not take the dinner with Jay-Z. That's right. I would not. I know. I would take the 500K. What? Jay-Z in his own words. These are Jay-Z's own words. The interviewer asked him, 500K or lunch with Jay-Z? Jay-Z said, you got to take the money, of course. That's right. Gail King said, but lunch with Jay-Z because the wisdom you get would be so beneficial for a person. Oh. Jay-Z said, you got all of that in the music for 1099. That's a bad deal. Take the 500K. Got it. Buy some of my albums. It's all there. Bruh. If you listen to the music, it's all there. Everything I said I wanted to do, I did it. Go ahead. That's the blueprint. Come on. But let me let you hear this from Jay-Z himself, all right? Come on. Let's go. There's something interesting online, Jay. I'd love to hear what you think about this. If you had a choice between getting paid $500,000 in cash uh -huh. or lunch with Jay-Z, yeah. Which would you choose? You gotta, take, you gotta take the money. What, you know, what I'm gonna say? That's right. Yeah, you know I mean everything that I'm gonna say. No, everything. no, only because people say, of course you take you take lunch with Jay Z because the wisdom that you would get from him, stupid, would would be so uh, beneficial to you. Stupid. It would only be a matter. You but, would take the money. Yeah, because you, you got the you got all that in the music for, for <laughs> 10.99. That's a that's a bad deal. I would I wouldn't tell you to cut a bad deal. That's like, right. Take know. the five hundred thousand. Go buy some albums and listen to the albums. <laughs> it's all there. If, if you, okay. you if you piece it together and really listen to the music for the words for what it is, it's all there. Everything that I said was gonna happen. Uh huh. Happen. Everything that I said I wanted to do, I've done. Uh huh. And th there's the blueprint. The blueprint, literally, to me and my life and my journey is is there already. So as you can see. Jay-Z himself even said he would take the 500K rather than sit down with dinner with him. I know. I don't know. Like, are you guys stupid? Are you guys slow? Why would you take a dinner with Jay-Z? Oh. You're gonna sit down and have dinner with Jay-Z, right? Just to gain knowledge, business knowledge. Most of the people that say, oh, I'll take the dinner with Jay-Z. They'll take the dinner with Jay-Z because they're probably millionaires or billionaires already, right? It's just more business now. That's right. But if you're someone coming from the mud, coming from the streets, yeah, and you're just trying to get it, you're gonna take the 500K. Yeah. But no one says that you're gonna take the 500K and blow it on a car, Bentley, or buy you a watch, or buy you some change and just blow the money. Most people will have some type of plan if you're gonna take the 500K. That's right. I would. Come on. Right? Come on. I came out the mud. I got mine from the mud. I'm used to wrestling. Uh huh. Right? Wrestling is grinding and hustling. What I would do? If I took the 500K, come on. I'm gonna invest. Go ahead. I'm gonna invest in stock. Go ahead. I'm gonna invest in real estate. Go ahead. I'm gonna open up a business. I'm gonna put it in CDs. I'm gonna get an IRA. I'm gonna get a 401K. Go ahead. Right? I'm gonna make that money make money for myself. Uh huh. Right? You gotta have a business plan. Plan out three years, four years, five years out what you plan to do. Go ahead. That money is life changing money. Most people in their whole life will never see 500K. That's right. So me sitting down with Jay-Z just for some business knowledge, not the business knowledge. I don't need the business knowledge if I already have business knowledge. I know what to do with money when I get it. I know. I'm not BMFing, I'm not blowing money fast. I'm gonna invest. Come on. I'm gonna make that money make money. I'm gonna double up, triple up. Come on. You gotta know what to do with finances. You gotta know how to manage your finances. Uh huh. So recently, Jay-Z was at a football game and a fan ran up on him. And this is what a fan said. Let's go. Uh, 500K. What? I ain't taking that dinner, I'm taking that 500K. That's right. You feel me? <laughs> hey, it's love though, you feel me? So you see what the fan said, right? Uh huh. He was excited, right, to see Jay-Z. He said, Jay-Z, I'm taking a 500K. Jay-Z, I'm taking a 500K. I'm that same fan. I'd have told Jay-Z the same thing. I'm taking a 500K. Yeah. I don't need the dinner. Dinner ain't gonna benefit me. One of you super fans that just wanna be around Jay-Z, just wanna be in his presence, that ain't gonna do nothing for me. I'm a hustler. I like getting money. Go ahead. You know what I'm saying? I like I like investing money. Go ahead. I like making my money make money. Go ahead. So that fan just said it right there. I'm gonna take the 500K. Uh-huh. 
But recently, Rick Ross just responded. Rose, would you take the half a million dollars for the dinner with Jay-Z? I'm going to take the dinner, and I'm going to tell you why. Stupid. In 08, before I turned in my second album, I had a meeting with Hov. We went to lunch. Philippe Child, Manhattan. The chicken, the orange chicken on the stick with the peanut sauce was the vibe at the time. Let me cut through all the conversation. He said, Rose, verse is writing to every beat you like, write to every record you can make work. Nice. He told me a quick story about Big Pimpin'. I said, okay, bet. So I went from writing one record to every 80 beats I like to writing 40 records out of every 80 beats I could make work. Uh huh. It took me to another level as a writer, another level as an artist. The amount of work I was putting out was next level. So you gotta ask yourself, are you ready to digest the knowledge or you just wanna look at this watch at the table? Right? So I understand Hov reply. Asking Jay-Z, would you take the money up? I get it. Y'all know Hover humble. He an arrogant, humble. I get it. He thinking of a motherfucker who ain't got nothing and only going to ask him about, yo, ho, what it was like when Tupac did hit him up. Come on now, dog. Nigga, nobody don't want to hear that shit. So I would tell you get the money too. That's right. But if you ready to digest the knowledge that he going to give you, I'm talking about from topic to topic, topic to topic. Come on, man. It's priceless. Rick Ross said, he kind of doubled back. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? He's like, yeah, Jay-Z's humble. You know, whatever, whatever. He's a hustler. Come on. This is what Jay-Z said. Come on. Right? But Rick Ross said he would take the dinner, oh, the sit down, God. just to get the business sense. But Rick Ross already got money. He's a millionaire. Stop the cap. He already has money. Uh-huh. So the 500K really ain't going to benefit him because he wants the business sense because he's in the entertainment industry. I know. Most people are not in the entertainment industry. That's right. So why would we take the dinner with Jay-Z where we can get the 500K and change our life completely? Bruh. Just understand where people are coming from. Understand people are going through hardships right now. People ain't got it. Uh huh. You got people out here robbing, stealing, killing, uh huh. just to get money, right? So if you're able to get 500K, yeah, boy. you're going to change your whole life, your family's life, Go ahead. your kids' life. Go ahead. Your friends like, Go ahead. right? You're going to do the right thing with that money. Uh huh. But I get what Rick Ross was saying, but it don't apply to 99.9% .9 of the people in the world today. That's right. It applies to that 1%. I know. You know, those rich, those rich people, those, those famous people, those millionaires, those billionaires that got money to blow. Yeah. 500K is nothing to guys like them. Uh huh. But that's just my take on the 500K or dinner with Jay Z. What? I'm not taking no dinner with Jay-Z. Yeah. I'm taking the 500K. That's right. And I know y'all feel the same way I feel. Uh huh. So what I need y'all to do is comment down below. Go ahead. Would you take the dinner with Jay-Z? Come on. Or would you take the 500K? Come on. And explain to me Go ahead. why you would take the dinner with Jay-Z. That's right. Or why you would take the 500K. Make it make sense, right? Oh. But come on. Definitely come on. 500K for me. I appreciate y'all tuning in. Uh -huh. I appreciate y'all watching this video. Uh -huh. Make sure y'all comment, like, subscribe. Go ahead. Hit the notification button. Go ahead. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Go ahead. Let's get the subscribers up. That's right. We need to run it up, run this video up. Yeah. I'm giving y'all great content. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Go ahead. And I'll see y'all next week uh -huh. with another episode. Go ahead. Of Get Right. Come on. Or Get Left. What? I'm out.